Well, guys, the eighth season of The Real Housewives of New Jersey kicked off this week, and the explosive cast sure brought the drama, but there are some major changes. No longer returning to the franchise is powerhouse Jacqueline Larita, who famously accused Melissa Gorga of having four nose jobs at the end of last season. Melissa opened up about her relationship with Jacqueline today and whether or not there is a chance of reconciliation. Watch. I have not spoken with her since. Um, I, I, don't, I don't like a lot of the ways that, you know, you saw what went down. I don't like when a girl breaks girl code and, like, you know, calls someone out on a nose job. Maybe they want anyone to know I had a nose job. <laughs> Well, no matter what you it know. Now it's not her everybody. story to tell. It was, exactly. That's the way to not put it, I think, right? Yeah. It, it wasn't her lie to tell. It wasn't her story to tell. It, it was in her like, place. Yeah. Any chance for reconciliation? I mean, I have no issues. I have no issues with her. I just have no desire to, you know, go to lunch either. How about Jacqueline and Teresa? I don't think they're ever going to be friends either. No chance. <laughs> yeah, I don't, I, I'm doubting that. All right. Do you think that Jacqueline was at all jealous of your relationship with Teresa? Um, I do think it, it was a problem for her. I think that um, she was so used to Teresa and I being divided. I, I don't think she knew what to do. And her role was always kind of like she playing the middle. It. Well, yeah, she she, she always kind of played the middle of like, okay, this one feels this way. And when we were together, I don't I don't I don't think it rubbed her the right way. I think she was lost. Like she was like, I don't know her trust. She had major trust issues with me the second I was good with my sister-in-law, and that annoyed me. Yeah. It's family. You don't come between family. That's a yeah, and that's another I didn't interesting like thing that, that, that doesn't did completely that. make sense when computing all that, right? Because right. of course you're because you're wasn't that sister in law should, should get along. Yes, yeah, right. Why it's good for you everyone want them if to get that works. Along. Right. That's yeah, off my heart. Yeah, sorting it all out there and taking Jacqueline's place, entrepreneur Margaret Josephs, Melissa, and former OG housewife Danielle Staub weighing in on the Jersey newbie, all agreeing that those pigtails, they pack a serious punch. Check this out. She's a powerhouse in pigtails, as you can see. <laughs> you like know that. what? She, I Perfect blend really well with her. She's an entrepreneur like I am. She's a businesswoman. Um, she's got great brands, a great company. She does not scare to speak her mind. I always say, listen, it's not easy to come onto the Real Housewives of New Jersey right. on season eight when we're very established. It and wasn't it's easy in season one. <laughs> <laughs> Doesn't matter. The history. No. Well, you know what? But that's fair. That's okay. fair. Yeah. Face. But yeah, she, she, she blends right in. Thanks. You know what? It, I've always been on a reality series since the day I was born, that's why I feel. So I came on the show, obviously Melissa said her and I get along great. I was nervous to meet Danielle after watching season one and two, but she's extremely nurturing and therapeutic Aww, and amazing. Um, Teresa's fabulous. I do clash a little with my hometown girl, Siggy. You want to take her and pull on those pigtails until they come out of her head. You wanted to rip out these pigtails. Can I mean, you believe it? Can, no, I can't believe it. Who doesn't love a girl in pigtails? I can't. I, I mean, well, we know one. Apparently, <laughs> we know one of them. Where do you stand now? Um, you know what? Uh, I obviously can, you know, move past anything. I don't think she's moved past it yet. She doesn't want to braid the pigtails. She might still want to rip them out. Well, thank God she, did. she obviously didn't rip them out. Yeah, yeah, she obviously didn't rip them out. But you know what? Um, you'll have to watch all the episodes to all right. really see what happens.